Hello and welcome back to And We Rolling. Today, you join me in Z Modeler 3. This is a Liberty Walk silhouette Huracan. And I said to myself, we can do that. So I'm going to start with the basics. I am going to take the hood off of this Huracan model, export it, put it into Cura, slice it. We're going to 3D print it and we're going to put it on the Huracan. And if that goes well, well, we'll see how far we can take it. But let's start with the hood. So what I'm gonna do is get rid of most of this stuff. Don't, we're not worried about all that right now. I just wanna see the hood. Don't leave that one. All right. So here we go. We're gonna go to polygon level. select by separated which pretty much selects the hood right there there's a few in here that's not selected grab those so it looks like we've got the hood and then looks like yep the bottom's good so we've got the hood selected what we're gonna do is go over to modify and we're gonna detach these polygons. So that gets the hood. Boom. Now I wanna see everything else. And I'm gonna go ahead and select all of it. And we're gonna go ahead and delete it because I don't, I don't care about that stuff right now. So we just have the hood. And with that hood, I'm going to export it. Okay, as you guys can see, I've been kind of testing this plan with it. So I've already exported the hood. I'm not going to export another one. So let's head on over to Cura. Hey Cura, here goes our hood. Now I haven't done anything to this hood except for take it from the model. So I don't know, I'm sure like people who 3D print or do this sort of thing they're probably like screaming right now like no you need to do all this other i don't know what i'm doing y'all i already said i don't know this is we, we we're, we're trying okay we're gonna try we're gonna try something so i'm going to go ahead and uh what are we doing we're gonna go ahead and preview because i've already sliced it and it looks like we're pretty much good to go When we're done we should have a nice little hood I've already printed a couple this is like my third test but I figured before we test um, printing out any more we should probably go ahead and cut the hood off my Huracan yeah well guys ain't no going back after this so let's go ahead head to the garage and cut off my hood this is my Lamborghini Huracan LP610-4. I took it out a couple nights ago and crashed it. So here we are. I love this car. I've had it for quite a while. Um, first it was yellow, then it was yellow and black. Now it's gray and red. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to bring this car back to life, but we're going to bring it back to life better than it's ever been before. Hopefully. Let's get started. I think the first thing I'm gonna do is sand off the scratches. I know it might seem like I like crashing cars around here with my track record, but honestly, it it does hurt my feelings, you guys, to see my cars in a state of disrepair. So I am going to set up some soapy water over here off camera. That's what y'all are hearing right now. And um Get some sandpaper. I got some 400 grit. So I'm gonna just start with that. It's not really necessary since technically we gonna be cutting off my hood today apparently. That's what we're doing. Um, but yeah, 
I, I gotta get these scratches off first because it's just it's hurting my soul it's hurting me you guys y'all ever crash our cars it just hurt it just hurt I think this is like my way of procrastinating on cutting the hood off because honestly you guys I don't know if that's a good idea um, I've had this car for a few years now and like I was saying earlier we've been through a lot me in this car man if I find the pictures I'll put them all in here for you guys but I definitely don't want to mess this up and once I cut that hood off it's probably not going back on so I better be sure I know what I'm doing and I'm not. But the only way to learn is to try, right? So we are gonna try and we are gonna bring this thing back better than ever before. All right, y'all, I'm probably gonna put this on like fast motion or whatever, speed it up. Cause who knows how long this is gonna take. And then once I'm done procrastinating with this sanding, I guess we'll get to cutting. Let me go ahead and get this taken apart, you guys, so I don't have to worry about the windows and stuff. Y'all can tell by the screws I got in here that I, I'll be playing with my stuff because everything, all these screws is rusty. All right, you guys, I've separated the body from the frame. So I think I'm done sanding for now. I'm gonna go ahead and tape up this hood. Hopefully it'll help me see the lines better. And we're gonna cut it off.
I missed. Oops. you guys let's see how bad I did on them cuts well it doesn't look too bad look like the the guiding lines helped a little bit I know I missed on this side right here though hopefully it wasn't too deep oh no I think I'm oh yeah there's a miss right there but doesn't look that bad. So I didn't cut like all the way because I was scared in the corners. I'm not going to lie to y'all guys. Ooh, that's a big old gash in the hood. But at least it seems like I got all on the inside so we could sand down the edges once I get the hood completely off. And then we'll fit the new hood. The only thing I'm nervous about so far, well, I'm nervous about a lot of things, but it was a uh, structural in here so this part is what connects it to the um frame of the car this is for the windows and the interior to line up so uh we gonna have some work cut out for us figuring out how to get those mountain points back um but yeah guys we sending it it's too late now i cut like look we cut it's cut there's no going back we just have to finish getting this last little bit off i might just have to um i don't know i'm gonna try to do it without cutting it again but it looks like i need to at least hit these corners right here and right here and then the rest of it should kind of follow suit so yeah i'm gonna be right back with y'all we're gonna finish getting this uh Getting this hood off. Yo, we popped the hood. I think it's the wrong way though. <laughs> we almost there, y'all. Here it comes. It's off. We did it. We cut the hood off the Lambo. Was that a good idea? I don't know. Because not only was there structural stuff that I'll show you guys, like so, the structural stuff here in these corners, which I had to cut as well. Um, there was stuff to hold the headlights in place, so we're gonna have to reimagine the front end for sure, but We did that where's where's where my test hoods at But when we finished y'all be throwing one of these in there We gonna throw well this one's too small, but y'all get the idea we gonna get the Measurements all right. We gonna we gonna slide through actually is this too small is it just my cut raggedy. Y'all get the idea. We coming through. Yeah, so I guess I'm going to sand down these edges. Um, 
try to get this hood to fit. But I'll probably just do that type of stuff off camera. That'll be it for this episode. I'll catch you guys in part two. Until next time, let's keep it rolling. Thank you.